When the latest eruption of the Swarzenegger volcanic system in the Sunduka crater chain started in the Reckoners Peninsula of Iceland, we expected it to be quick, like the previous ones, just a few days and after that nothing. A fissure opened south and north. The north one died out very quick, but the south one was spreading like a wildfire and almost touching the town of the Grindavik before it actually it was stopped by the uh, lava defenses we have around that area. It was diverted toward the sea. We expected it reached the sea. It didn't. And it has started to actually uh, become localized. Uh, 14 went were there, 9 reduced, I named them. K1 is the last remaining one, which happened to suffer from a lot of events, including this big crush. Practically the walls of it collapsed and the cauldron emptied. It became localized in that sense. It was erupting on a platform created by its own lava flow. After many modifications, this is the situation. The platform is around, in my estimate, 15 to 20 meters. The average flow of lava actually has decreased over this time. And it's kind of stable around 3.5, 2.6, 2.2. Um, what we also are seeing is that the volume of the erupted lava also has steadily increased. We are now at the 33.2 million cubic meters. But the area reached almost a constant level. We are not seeing an extension of this beyond what it was already. It's becoming very localized uh, and the, the depth of it also is becoming average around 5, 5.4, around those uh, numbers. Whatever I said is summarized in this one single important diagram. You can see it from the evolution of this uh, latest eruption as you can see here, is becoming more localized by the 15th of the April. As you can see here again, I'm showing you most of the thickness is now happening around the K1 crater. What is more interesting is what I'm showing you now. Since the first eruption in the December, steadily the land have risen under the sourcing volcanic system. It didn't come back to the original level, 60 centimeters so far. That means the land is permanently risen because there's lava under it is solidified. Every time a little bit is added, some of it erupts, but most of it stays there and adds to the mass of the land, have an uplift in the land. So you can see that every time rising, 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 never coming exactly back to the same position. This is important. We are adding height to this area. The area is rising gradually. This is what I wanted to say.